What's up guys? MJ coming at you with another video. This time we're gonna go deep inside the application of uh, Samsung Gear Icon X 2018 and I'm going to show you how we can actually uh, uh, go through the software and uh, actually monitor your gear icon when it comes to battery, notification, etc. So I'm recording through this camera and this is the Xiaomi uh, Mi A1 camera. I'm testing it to see if it's a good plug or not. Uh, please give me your opinion about it. Uh, oh, let's just see. First off, I have my uh, Huawei Mate 10. Uh, this phone is amazing. So let's go through the software. So this is, as you can see, the Samsung gear. Once you get inside here, it it'll ask you to turn on the Bluetooth. So I'll just turn on the Bluetooth and it's gonna uh, seek a look for the Icon X, which is, it's over here. Uh, let's just wait and see if it connects to it. So, let's give it a little bit of charge. Let's go through the software first. So as you can see, You'll, you'll find the info first. So it's gonna tell you the battery percentage for each uh, earbud. So the left one shows you, as you can see, the battery, and the right one has the uh, battery as well. Now, if you click on tips, oh, it has to be connected. Uh, so once it's connected, I'm gonna show you what's gonna happen here. Here, uh, you'll see the earbud volume, so you can adjust it from here, and music. Also, it plays from here, so you can even choose your music from your phone, or you can use it through your earbuds by tapping on the earbud itself. Um, we have here as well, you can choose if you want to play music from your phone through Bluetooth or from your uh, earbuds, which is uh, actually installed on it so it, it has four gigabyte of RAM so you can put music inside your earbuds that way you save battery more and you can also install your Samsung uh, health uh, as health so you can even check your heart rate your steps etc so you can even link it to other applications here if you go to the setting uh, you'll see uh, there's music control feedback so you can choose your tracks through here uh, you can manage notification. You can allow like different type of notifications to be connected. Let's try it out. So you can even manage notification through the, your uh, notification management and exercise as well. It has the. Uh, uh, audio guide is coach like a coach in your ears that tells you what to do it's kind of different but maybe you have to give it a try uh, you, you find my gear if you lost your gear or something the phone will detect where your gear at if it's connected and you can choose your ambient sound and we have the voice, voice language control sorry so you can choose, choose your own language so here's the deal once it's connected or charged, all you have to do is just press the Bluetooth. If it's first first time, just hold the Bluetooth button. A blue light will uh, show up here, and it's gonna connect to your phone. Now, what do you need to do if you are actually did connect to your phone before? Just have this phone with you, and while it's charging, just open it and press connect. And it's connected as you can see the battery on the right side see this is the touchpad uh, instructions single tap play and pause double tap play and extract answer the, or end call triple tap play previous track hold and touch or touch and hold touch and hold hold and touch uh, read a lot menu options or decline call so Double tap and hold. Go to the next playlist. This function works when play music is from your gear. So yeah, remember if you install music there, one tap and then tap and hold, 
and we'll get you to the next playlist. Volume up, down, slide, swipe up, swipe down. You have to make sure that you're swiping up and down correctly, not touching the pad, then swipe. So just make it as a uh, motion of swipe down and then swipe up. So uh, here you can choose your exercise, but uh, this is for your uh, exercise. So I'm just gonna tell you where you can have store your data. So used to track your exercise. This is this option actually for me it doesn't matter because either one is gonna you know track my exercise. Because at the end of the day the app I'm gonna show me all what I need. I'm not gonna check things with, with my gear icon. So this is about the uh the battery percentage is pretty low. This one is out, as you can see, air air volume. So now it's connected there. If you go to setting, let's go to notification, turn it on, and here you can manage your notification. So I allowed only messaging, missed call, and emails. And I can allow all or about anything I want, WhatsApp and everything. So we, if you have a messaging from WhatsApp, it's not going to read the WhatsApp message. It's going to tell you WhatsApp, for example. And you have to go check the message by yourself from your phone. So uh, so this is one of the uh, notification uh, options that you can have. Anyways, guys, if you have any other questions, please let me know. Hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you had uh, some info. Please let me know how's the Xiaomi Mi A1 recording this video. Is it good? Is it bad? Let me know your answers. If you have any questions regarding Gear Icon X and how actually you can uh, link it to the your phone and stuff, please let me know. Take care and have fun. See you guys later.